Hello, I'd like to talk to you today about Nintex Workflow 2010 and what makes it special and powerful. Rather than the normal PowerPoint thing, let's try something different. Why Nintex Workflow? Well, for starters, Nintex is made up of very, very clever SharePoint people. We started working with SharePoint when the product came to being. Some of us actually came from Microsoft itself, and we built a version of Nintex technology for every edition of SharePoint ever. Our motto is workflow for everyone, and that starts absolutely with users. But everyone also means developers, or designers if you would, professionals creating high-end automation apps. And finally, everyone also includes IT, the people that need to make sure not only workflow runs smoothly, but SharePoint itself. In every case, workflow needs to be easy. Easy to draw, design, deploy, change, update, secure, and most importantly, easy to understand. A common mistake is to design for developers only. You can have users come to developers to get their solutions built for them and make them happy. They're professionals, they know what they're doing, they can build stuff well, we get it. They'll be able to make people happy for a time, until the inevitable takes place. There's going to be one request too many at the same time, and the inevitable response is going to be to ask someone to wait. You can imagine what the reaction will be when faced with that. You can also imagine what the succession of reactions will be as more and more people have to wait. There's an eventual revolt and developers become victims of their own success. And your crew of developers effectively become a bottleneck. And if that's not your problem, well, this probably is. Again, you start with a user with a business problem that can be solved with workflow who goes to a developer for help with addressing this. In the best of all possible worlds, you'd be able to get the user and the developer to mind meld. But life is not like Star Trek and mind melds aren't real. In the real world, users ask for requirements the developers try to build to them. And even when they're good at it, on the first try, what we ask for isn't always what we want. Or you build the requirements, they are what you want, but not anymore. The world has a way of changing on a fairly regular basis. The Gartner Group did a recent study of companies that do business process management. They asked how often business processes change. And two-thirds change every six months, 18% monthly, 10% weekly, 4% daily. One out of ten companies change workflows weekly. How do you keep up? You design workflow for everyone. You begin by creating great tools that allow users to create many of the workflows they need all by themselves. And then you add to that extra functionality that developers need in order to do professional work. They're not the same, mind you. Users tend to think of workflows as process documents, whereas developers think of them as applications. Users will revise workflows like documents. They'll make changes in place. They'll circulate them for approval. Developers will put them through build, test, production deployment cycles. Users will generally want to string together building blocks that they know and understand. Developers will, in many cases, create building blocks of their own. Users might automate documents. Developers will connect to apps and data in other places. Users will probably draw linear logic. Developers need to model complex, complete logic, including looping, states, and such. Nevertheless, those needs are actually pretty complementary. The good news is that one tool, Nintex Workflow, spans the chasm. It's a solution that runs in any browser that gives you over 100% of the ease of SharePoint Designer and 85-90% to of the power of Visual Studio. SharePoint workflows start either based on a direct user instruction or based on a change to a list item or document. SharePoint takes that and sends it along its way to SharePoint's native workflow engine based on Windows Workflow Foundation. Most products take a different approach, derailing that process and sending the work along to a proprietary engine of their own design. We don't do that. SharePoint's native workflow engine is actually really, really powerful. Instead, we hitch things to it, like a best-of-breed workflow designer, a huge collection of out-of-the-box workflow tools, and a whole set of facilities for managing and reporting and securing workflows. And the whole thing's made out of SharePoint assets. It's web parts, it's event receivers, it's Windows Workflow Foundation components, it's not an extra engine or extra servers or services, it's 100% pure SharePoint. 
Keep heading down this track and you'll enter a roundhouse that can connect you to lots of line of business apps like SAP, Siebel, Project Server, CRM, and more. And we do this with industry standard protocols so you can reach whatever you want. From formal processes to mashups, from quick and easy to robust and powerful, we're users, developers, designers, and IT alike. You'll find that Nintech's Workflow 2010 is truly workflow for everyone. Visit www.nintex.com and request a 30-day trial.